Luckily, I got a second chance there. Noah really, uh, he torched me on that first restart, and he pulled me by three car lengths there. And I thought I might have had something for him on the outside, but luckily uh, there was a quick caution. We got the line back up again. I had a better restart where then we were just battling. And we've, uh, we've raced each other hard this whole year, and we're usually not the guys that are up front in the front row. And just us two racing each other hard all out. <laughs> It was, uh, we both knew we were either gonna, one of us was going to win and one of us was going to end up on the record. And I think we were racing that way. And uh, just awesome to finally get a, a real win, a, a feature win here. And uh, just a great past four weeks. We had a win, uh, a third place, and the TC Christopher win. It's just, it's been great end of the season for us and the, the whole team and the whole Chassis Pro team. Uh, just a, a great group of guys. and. It's just awesome to finally get a win here, and I think I'm the 10th, 10th SK winner here this year, and uh, it's just crazy. It's been a, been a great year, uh, great competition all around, just hard racing all year. Just seat time. Uh, I've been, this is my fourth year in division, my senior year, and I think I gained respect from a lot of people, and that's, that's what I was trying to get. And uh, Some people you'll never get that from, and that's fine, but just to uh, race people respectfully and gain it out there where they'll race you the same way is what it's all about. And, uh, We've uh, gone through a lot over the past four years, uh, ups and downs, and uh, it's great to finish a year like this with the win, go through the whole season with the win. It's just uh, off season for the win. It's just awesome to finally get a feature win here. You got two people that really wanted to try and win, and uh, it came down to the wire. We put on one heck of a show. Yeah, it sucked in the middle of the season. I had a broken hand, and that kind of benched us for like six or six to eight weeks and then we figured out some stuff that was wrong with the car uh, in the off, or in the off week last week and we've been good ever since so it's a good sign for next year really good finish I mean uh, the race kind of played to our favor at the beginning and then just uh, we started getting a little bit snugger than we liked um definitely better on this side of the spectrum than the other spectrum than we had last week we were definitely way too loose um me and Robbie went to work this week we made a bunch of changes and uh Definitely heading in the right direction. It just kind of sucks. We only had two races to figure this thing out. So um, definitely going to have a good head of steam going into the next year. And then, uh, you know, uh, hopefully we can click off a couple of these wins that I've been looking for. So, yeah, we'll, we'll be back full time next year with the TA4. Um, you know, trying to get get a little bit more notoriety towards these TFR guys. I mean, they don't get enough, uh, they don't get enough um, for lack of a better word, attention. You know, I mean, uh, what goes on in that joint, I mean, it's, it's second to none, you know. I mean, uh, Working up there for the past month building this race car has been a real, really, really, really cool journey. You know, I learned a lot and, you know, realized how, how far off we were from where we needed to be. So, I mean, uh, definitely an eye-opener and uh, really looking forward to the experience.